If you are looking into buying cheap and safe FIFA coins, look no further than footcoinshop.net. They have the fastest service, an incredible loyalty reward system, and the best prices around. Use my creator code INCEPTION when you sign up for your account and get a 5% discount with your order. Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here, and welcome to another video. This Martinelli card, base-wise, looks nice. Looking decent so far. Technical plus as well, eh? Okay. Okay. Looking forward to the videos, Nep. Uh, Gabriel Martinelli, 5'10", high, high work rates, 5-star skills, 4-star weak foot. Mostly explosive player, right-footed as well. Uh, play styles. Regular finesse shot, too. That's pretty good. Regular finesse shot and Trivella. Flare, rapid, rapid and quick step with technical plus. Good play styles. Yeah, good play styles. I like it. Outside foot passes and shots. Yeah, 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 that's nice. I like that. Okay. Um, Hawk chemistry style? Hunter, Hawk chemistry style? Dribbling is a little bit weird. Dribbling is a little bit weird. Um, okay. How tall are you again? Five foot ten. That's a weird cutoff. What's his body type? Martinelli. Do, do, do. Martinelli. Uh -uh. Martinelli. Okay, so Martinelli's dribbling. Uh, okay. What are people usually giving him? Hunter? Probably. <laughs> you always give Hunter regardless, bro. It doesn't matter. Uh, yeah. I mean, you, if you're gonna be using this car in the side positions, for sure. Even though he has finesse shot, I'd still use him on the right side, like in, in the actual right wing position. That's where I would use him mostly. Um, Hunter to boost pace, shooting. Passing's in a good area. Dribbling is the weird one. I have to experiment with that because he's 5'10", lean body type. Because I would assume that these maybe make it feel a little bit weird. But when you're in the side positions, it's not as bad to work with. So hopefully that still feels good in game. Here's the thing. The dribbling is not in a crazy area, but he has technical plus, which is crazy. Okay. It would have been nice with a marksman, though. That's what I was, like, thinking initially. But the pace is just not... The pace might not be in a horrible situation, but here's the thing, right? It's the it's the quick step and the rapid. You want to work with those two things as well. You know what I'm saying? That's Because the, uh, the rapid and the, the quick step, you know? Pace being higher on a hunter. Kind of makes sense. Um, stamina, 85. So you can actually use him on a push forward, come back instruction sort of thing. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get the card. And I'll show you guys how we line them up. Okay, guys, so we'll just be using him in a team like this. Oh, my legs. My legs. Um, yeah. Uh, Martinelli will just be using him in the side positions for the most part because he has the high, high work rates. So he can basically, like, push forward, come back. I might switch him and Gabriel Jesus just for the sake of the review, right? We'll just, do be, we'll just be doing this just to see um, what makes the most sense. But, um, yeah, go ahead and try him out, man. Hopefully he's a beast. Good goal, good goal. Good build up play. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Give him a second, give him a second. Oof. Dribbling is not too bad. The technical plus will definitely be very helpful. Oh, nothing there. Nothing there. Have to do a little bit of extra stuff. Touch. Shoot. Oh, have to do more extra stuff there. Get it. There we go. Good stuff, guys. Good stuff. Oh, wow. The finishing on the weak foot there was still kind of like in the middle, eh? But because if we didn't hit it green, that would have probably not have gone in. I'll tell you that right now. Ah, I couldn't get it off. Oh, 
nothing on the goal. Man. Good movement, though. The movement was sick. That's going to be the vibes with him, bro. Is that technical plus, right? Nice. Quick on the skill move there. Utilize that technical. Ball roll scoop. Touch again. Technical again. Ah, unlucky. Oh, wow. The ball roll didn't work. Oh, he made him bro on the on the elastical, on the L1 elastical. Hilt, hilt, FIFA mechanics. Hilt, hilt. Let's go bottom left. Well done. Ah, crossbar. Crossbar. It do be the crossbar. doing he's obviously positioned there i'm not shooting into the near post because i'm stupid nice i did the uh l1 r1 there let it go through his legs this is his pace by the way is with a hunter his running animation is like not that crazy so that's what makes me kind of want to give him like a marksman, you know what I'm saying? Like he doesn't have like the craziest running animation. Like even that's even before his stamina started to deplete, you know? Couldn't get this shot off there. Good build up, good build up, good job, good job. Oh, we hit the post. Oh, I couldn't time it because he did like a weird dribble on it there. Unlucky, man. Oh, I don't score that. I have to settle that. There it is. The FIFA mechanics. Van Dyke got cooked there, bro. I, I'm not going to use the word cooked because that's an overpowered mechanic. So that's like, we'll use 10% cooked for that. Dude, I'm looking at my Hullet video and I get the ball randomly. <laughs> what? Go Martinelli. Little trigger. Go back in. Ness. There it is. You guys won't believe this, but I gave him an edge in chemistry style. <laughs> I'm not joking. I already gave it to him like two, two goals ago, something like that. Oh. Click it back here. There we go. Nice and controlled. Very 
Even the passing is a little bit better on that engine, huh? No! Ah. Oh, got a green man in this game. You got a green. And there's also the fact that I don't have the hunter on him anymore. There we go. I like it. 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 Whoop! Hold on, hold on, one more. Whoop! No! Shot cancel? There it is. Hey, listen, I'll tell you this right now. Like, I noticed it right away. For me, I had to give him an engine. Because the, the base dribbling, I was like, I wasn't feeling it. Sure, I have to work with lower shooting, but, like, dude, I, I gotta give him the pace boost because of the rapid in the... because of the rapid in the quick step. And I want to be able to utilize the, the five star skill moves with quickness because I got to boost that agility and balance. That balance part, it was, it was the thing, you know? This is the visitors team for today. Aaron Ramsdale is in goal. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Vamanos. Vamanos. No, not to him. I'm trying to go for the other guy making that run in the middle. But we're chilling. Oh, we're not chilling. Oh my goodness. I, I thought we were like good, good there. Whoop. Little flick. Little R1. Utilize that technical. Whoop. That's a penalty. See, that's why I wanted to give him the engine boost too. Hey, oh, why do they do that? Why? What, what the devs, man? Why are you guys letting people pause on penalties, huh? Why? For what reason? Woo -woo. There we go. There we go. Go back out. No, there's no way. We're back in. Scale move, flick, elastico, shot cancel. See, this is why I give him the dribbling boost. Like, I'm sorry to say, but I like I felt it like snap of the fingers kind of vibes, you know? Go Martinelli. Little technical. There it is. Ball roll. Technical again. Don't overcommit it. Use that attacking AI. There we go. Let's do this. Technical again. There it is. Elastico. L1. Go back in. Ooh. Eh, sometimes I give it. Sometimes. Uh. You know what I want to try with him? I want to try this. Get the ball back. Little fakes. Ah, couldn't get it off. Very nice. Very nice, boys. That's what I like to see. Oh! No! Ah, I'm probably should have gone for the near post there instead. What's it? There we go. The ball. Touch! 
Ah. Uh... There we go. Actual football. Look at that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's go, Martinelli. Yeah, if I have an engine on him, the shooting is going to be... Like, especially from the super, super low percentage of strikes, it's going to be a little bit strange, right? So... Nice. A typical meta goal, you know. Get that track back angle. Attacking AI in that wing position, you know, he finds himself in the middle areas with it really nicely, right? Like whenever I'm building up that play to get that angle. Can't go wrong with that, you know. The skill moves are going to come off a little bit better when I give him that engine, you know, like just just to be able to accelerate out of it and stuff, you know. I had it there too. There we go. Good build up. Ball roll, ball roll. Little skill move. Back in. Take it out a little bit. Shot cancel. Shoot. See, I'm always scared about pressing the button the second time. You see how he red timed it? That's what I'm saying, my dude. I tell you guys this all the time in all my reviews, man. See, helpful to have more dribbling because of that stuff too. Pass it off right away. One, two. You're gonna still be on side. Skill move. Ball roll scoop. There you go. Use that technical. And that's it. Use a technical to get into the space. Elasco into the strike. Ooh, see you later. Oh man, I try to I try to like work some spaces there, but I get a little bit too close sometimes. Oh, I got talking out, bro. I got talking out. Okay. <laughs> Defending this game is just something, man. player i do this bro hey martinelli has good free kicks let's see we'll go here and then we'll go here and then we'll go here oh hello ah not enough Okay, guys, so final verdict on the new Martinelli card. So this one is a little bit of a weird one, okay? It's a weird one because of the price that he's at and the way that he feels in game. So the thing that threw me off right off the bat for the price of the SBC especially, right, was the way that his dribbling was formatted. But you guys know me. Every single time I'll go into the game, I got to try it out first. I got to see what's up with the card first and then go from there, right? So... What we did is we gave him a Hunter chemistry style, and I wanted to use the base card stats for dribbling as it was. Right off the bat, I could already feel I got to give him like a finisher chemistry style or an engine chemistry style 
for me, the engine chemistry style seemed to be the best fit. I'm going to explain to you guys why, okay? The reason why I had to give him the finisher or the engine chemistry style is because I felt right away that I needed a dribbling boost on the card, right? I needed to be able to utilize the pace play styles that the card has with the quick step and the the rapid because guys when i gave him the hunter the dribbling just felt weird sometimes and then the pace didn't feel that crazy because his running animation doesn't feel super fast his running animation in particular some cards are like that right like they have 99 acceleration 99 sprint speed you boost the play styles with the rapid and, and quick step but you guys can visually see from the gameplay that when i had him on a hunter his running animation, like during that one clip while I was showing you guys where it's like, oh, it's not that crazy. That's on a hunter, right? So when I see stuff like that right away, I'm like, okay, I got to give him like a finisher. I got to give him an engine because I got to utilize other areas of the card. Those other areas is the technical plus part and the skill moves part. The skill moves part of the card, when I provided him with the engine chemistry style, just felt better, right? Because I can utilize it a little bit more. I can accelerate into positions a little bit quickly. And attacking AI wise, even if I don't give him a shooting boost of any sorts, like even if, look, if I were to give him like a finisher, obviously you can improve attacking, positioning, finishing, shot power, and dribbling. Gonna be honest with you guys, I wouldn't put it past people to actually give him this chemistry style just because of that massive shooting boost. Because guys, even when I had the Hunter on him for 95, you can see that some of the shots I took with him were kind of like middle based for some of the strikes anyway. So I was like, I'm just gonna give him an engine and just work for the green time strikes. You know, that's because that's how this game kind of like generally performs in general, right? But the positioning was still fine. Like even, even when I had him on the engine chemistry style, I just liked being able to utilize the skill moves more, uh, pass the ball a little bit better as well, right? For my general buildup play, because this is a card that I'd rather use in the right-sided areas anyways. Now, for me personally, guys, I gotta be the guy to say it. These, uh, these prices for these cards, for the way that EA is formatting them, is a little bit weird you know our, our i think uh r2 guy or not l2 uh it's not r2 guy excuse me l2 guy this guy went on christmas break he's with his family chilling right now right with the way that they're pricing some of these guys it's a cool card to get regardless guys like you guys can see it we were still we were still able to do work with him because having five star skills with a technical plus is a really really nice variable to work with but for me I can work with it more when I gave him that engine, that agility, balance, and dribbling boost. Not everyone's gonna feel this way, but for me personally, the card just feels weird in the dribbling department with a hunter. I, I just preferred him on the engine, even if I'm sacrificing the shooting on the card, it just felt like a better card to use when I did all those things with him, specifically using him in the right wing position. I played my center forward within the first like five minutes in game. I was like, I gotta switch him because this is not his natural position. This is not where he's supposed to be, right? So I always do that guys with most of my reviews. I'll pause the game. You can see me pause at the top and I'm like, right away, I gotta switch him, right? Um, the card was still really cool to use, but you just gotta work your high percentage strike angles as much as possible. You gotta green time your strikes as much as possible with this card, 100%, it's the type of player. He's just very, very strangely formatted for the price that he's at. So that's what it is. Because guys, even if I went in the direction of giving him like a Hawk chemistry style, right? Or I gave him like a Hunter chemistry style, like you can't have base card stats for dribbling like this for the price of the card being as it is. It would have been nice. It would have been nice for the price if base card stats wise, he's already on those dribbling stats for an engine. I would be okay with the reactions and ball control being as it is. But if he was at this for base card stats, right in the dribbling department even you know you give him that uh that pace boost and all that kind of stuff and then i can give him like a dead eye or something right i can give him a dead eye but the base card stats for dribbling was improved to be in that area for an engine even with the pace as well cool beans you know what i'm saying cool beans with the card especially with the way that your gameplay plays in game right but it's just one of those types of situations i still think the card is cool five star skills working with technical plus you can do a lot of work with you guys saw we were doing we were we were saucing it up a little bit with this card he's quick on it when i gave him that engine right and then the technical to just bob and weave one side bob and weave into the other side was great as well but i don't know man these arsenal cards ea has been doing the thing with the prices on these guys too because it did the same thing to odegaard and regardless of what youtube guys say right you don't really see Odegaard used that much unless it's more for like the sentimental route more than anything. So it's one of those types of situations, guys, with these types of players. But did I enjoy him? I did. The attacking AI was fine. The dribbling was fine once I gave him that engine to boost the pace, all that kind of stuff. I just wish that the card was formatted in the pace and the dribbling department like this by default while I could provide him at the Deadeye at that price point. That's what I would say, okay? 
Thank you guys for watching the video. I'll catch you guys for the next one. Peace out, dudes. Love you guys.